Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Kennedy. There's not really a good place to put this camera in this rental car, so I think I will just hold it. I just landed in Maine. I flew into the Bangor Airport. I am going to Acadia National Park and Bar Harbor for the next like four days. It's Friday. It's about five o'clock right now. My hotel is a little bit over an hour. It's an hour and 19 minutes is what it says, so I'll get there around 6.15 check in go get dinner i'm so excited i'm not gonna do any hiking or anything today i'm just gonna like check in go out to dinner kind of like chill but then the next two days i'm gonna be hiking exploring i'm so excited i've never been to maine so this is a little solo trip a little solo national park bar harbor trip so yeah i'm gonna jam out to taylor swift midnights and do my little hour and a half drive or hour and 18 minutes it said 19 now it says 18 so <laughs> okay we'll do a little fit check before i leave it's kind of basic but i just have these jeans from american eagle and then i have on my little fake birkenstocks this sweater is also from american eagle it's like a little bit of like a mock neck and then this is h&m sorry i just like set you on the microwave <laughs> And then this is my bag. I think I got it from Express. I can probably link it below. But I love this bag for like fall and winter. I'm not even going to do my makeup just because I don't feel like it. And like I said, I'm starving. I'm probably going to get a beer and a lobster roll. That's like the plan. So hopefully the place I'm going. So it's like Friday at like 6 o'clock. And it's probably closer to 630 now. So there's probably going to be a wait, but I'm just by myself. So hopefully either a table opens up or I can sit at the bar. We'll see. But hopefully I don't have to wait too long. like a struggle to find a bagel it's like about 10 o'clock right now on a saturday so and these places were saying they're open online but i went to like two different places to try to get a bagel and they were closed but i got a breakfast sandwich and then i got a coffee which right after i ordered it i realized oh my gosh wait i didn't say iced because they had this sign that i showed that said like try our like brown sugar oat milk latte kind of thing which is what i always get at starbucks but the one at starbucks is iced and i forgot to ask for iced so i just got a hot one which i never drink hot coffee i literally only drink iced coffee so i think i need to wait for a second for it to cool down i have like a flannel and then my puffer but in my car right now i'm really hot it's like a little chilly out but as you can see it's still sunny so it's kind of perfect but yeah I'm gonna drink maybe I shouldn't maybe I can uh try my coffee I'm just scared it's gonna be too hot it was a little hot <laughs> it was good I would love it if it was iced but I literally realized as I was walking away I was like oh I'm pretty sure like it's just a regular latte and I didn't say iced so but that's okay and then at that point i was like i'm not gonna go over there and tell her iced so it's fine but yeah we're gonna go do some hiking girls <laughs> when i put in the national park like the entrance station it literally says it's eight minutes away like bar harbor is legit like right outside of it once i get like the map and stuff we'll see how far it is to like where i'm actually going but it's like very close so <laughs> let's go
to Sand Beach, which is really pretty, and now I'm at Thunder Hole. So I'm kind of just like driving around like the main like park loop and then pulling off wherever I want to. So I've seen stuff about Thunder Hole online and it's basically like a big spot where like waves come in. So let's see. That's the thing about hot coffee though is like now it's like cold but not like ooh like iced coffee like it's just like room temperature. I feel like that's it like you have such like a short amount of window to drink hot coffee because it's like too hot and then it gets room temperature. I feel like you have like 15 minutes to drink it but... So I was just at that little lookout point that I showed you. It's like literally like right there. It's like a three minute walk. And then I walk back to my car. I get back to my car and my be real went off. So now I gotta do a little two minute walk back so I can have a cool be real. Cause I don't know if I've ever had a cool one. So this isn't fake cause I was just there two minutes ago. Guys, I got it. It's taking forever to load. That's a pretty good one. I'm satisfied. So the only place that I've even tried to take pictures of myself was the first place I went sand beach besides that I've like taken you know some pictures on my phone like of like the view and like taken some clips for the vlog but like I haven't taken any pictures of me in them because so I I don't care if people see like there's a difference like okay when I'm at the beach like in Florida I will take photos with my iPhone tripod even though it's like other people can see me like I don't it's not that I care about like being embarrassed like I don't care about that but like there's some places where it's like not practical to take out your iPhone tripod when you're like in people's way you know and so that's like when I wouldn't do it so that's why the place I was able to do it so far was Sand Beach because it's like pretty open so you can really like I just went off in the corner and I wasn't by anyone but like all these little lookout points there's like too many people for me to like pull out my iPhone tripod so I went to this is just like a random little like pull off like there's no parking lot there's just like basically room for two spaces there's a car behind me but I think they're about to leave but yeah this probably isn't like the number one best view of everything I've seen but I feel like if I go over here I might be able to get some good ones I don't know but this is the first place where there's not like a ton of people so I'm gonna like try and see because like I do like to like get photos where I am like one I like to post on Instagram duh but also <laughs> also why is everyone pulling off here go away Literally go away. There's not room for you here. Ugh. I'm being mean, okay? I'm at a national park. I should... Oh, she drove off. Thanks, girl. Oh, but I like to have, like, memories of, like, places. And it. I while it is cool to, like, have photos of the view, it's, like, way cooler to have pictures of you in them. So, let's go try. I already did take a couple pictures in this flannel. So, I might change into... I have this, like, orange jacket from Forever 21. But it looks like that Free People jacket. So, I might try to do that. But we'll see if there's anywhere I can even put my tripod here. So... TBD guys good news. I got some good ones. I can maybe put them on the screen or you can follow me on Instagram I'll try to insert some here, but I actually got good ones. So I'm excited and this jacket is very fall vibes So it was cute I'm on the Jordan pond path and it's basically just like a loop around I'll show you some clips because it's so pretty but it's nice because it's just extremely flat and just around so it's like super easy 
and so pretty. It's been a little bit of an eventful morning and it's only 6.45, but basically Cadillac Mountain in um, Acadia is the first place in the US that you can see the sunset, apparently, from like October 7th to like March or something. It's like those six months of the year, basically fall and winter. And up until either yesterday or the day before, I think yesterday you had to have a reservation there's like a parking lot at the top and normally you either need reservations for sunrise or for like during the day to be able to park there because I think it gets like really crowded and stuff and that's how they can like contain it but you don't you can't you can't even make it's not that you don't even need it's you can't even make reservations anymore as you can see I'm not at the top of a mountain so basically I woke up at like I set my first one for 5.50, but I think I actually woke up at like 6.15 by the time I like brushed my teeth, got dressed, whatever, left. Then it's only 15 minutes from my hotel, like to the top. But when I got there, there's already like a park ranger telling everyone like no. So it must have been full. So thankfully I have another day here, but I did think like today's literally Sunday. Like it's going to be so busy. Like I thought that I was like, this is like... I, I when I left to drive there I was like I don't even know if this is gonna work but we'll try but as you can see it didn't so I just drove to like the waterfront so I'm like well I might as well watch the sunrise somewhere so I mean I'm already up this early as you can see it is 6 45 it's not gonna focus so I'm listening to midnight 6 46 thankfully I am also here tomorrow so I leave tomorrow but Oh my god, my clip is driving me nuts. I leave tomorrow, but I don't leave till the afternoon. So I'm going to try it tomorrow morning. I think it'll be less busy because one, it's a Monday. And two, it's supposed to rain. But I'll go even if it's raining. I don't care. I'm from Seattle. I'm used to the rain. Okay? <laughs> but actually, I'll go in the rain. I don't really mind. Since I was already up, I decided to get a coffee and a breakfast sandwich uh, before I go back to the hotel because I think I'm just gonna chill out for a little bit and then I'm gonna do a hike later but I'm gonna like chill for a little bit because yeah it's my vacation so if I want to chill I'm gonna chill I got the same drink as yesterday but this time I remembered to ice for ask for iced it's really good it was good yesterday but I like it even better going on <laughs> um oh my god it's so cold like okay i was just thinking my <laughs> when i was walking back to my car i was thinking okay main slays but like i do not miss the cold Ugh. but it does slay i don't even know what i'm saying right now okay i don't think i showed you guys my outfit once i got ready but i'm wearing this white h&m sweater abercrombie jeans and then my same little fake birkenstocks so I wanted to take a little like fall picture like with the leaves and everything so this is the road to get to the park and I just like pulled off on a little thing I remember when I drove past this yesterday I was like this could be like a good picture there's just like this little I don't even know what it is but it's like a little trail thing so I just took some pictures right here I can insert them or like always you can follow me on Instagram but Oh my god, I almost feel like I should take like a selfie. Like look how cute this is. It's all fall vibes. And then this um, orange jacket is from Forever 21, but it looks like the Free People one. And I absolutely love it. Wait, I really want to take a selfie now. I never really take selfies, but I feel like that would be cute. So let me try. <laughs> Okay, it was like a 30 minute drive, but I'm at the lighthouse. I also have like my clog shoes on and I do not feel like changing into my sneakers, but I feel like these will be fine. I'm trying to look at everyone else's shoes and everyone else has on sneakers, but it's like, I mean, I would have on sneakers too if I didn't just put on a cute outfit before this. 
I'm just gonna keep this on. I think it'll be fine. I feel like it's fine. I don't know. I don't wanna look dumb, but I guess I don't really care. I'm tired, I'm so hungry. I'm actually so hungry. And th this is small parking lot, but, okay, people are wearing jeans. That lady has on like jeans and like a sweater, so I feel like it's fine. After this, I'm gonna go get food because I am hungry. Definitely getting a lot. I'm like having lobster every day, but it's like I'm in Maine. I have to have lobster. Okay, my clogs were definitely fine. It's just a path, so these are fine. <laughs> were kind of not ideal once I got to the rocks but that that was kind of not worth it I mean it's fine but like you don't need to come here <laughs> just being honest it was okay but it was like kind of out of the way so now I'm gonna go get something to eat Okay, I forgot my camera because I was in such a rush, but it is like 6.30 or 6.40 in the morning. I was able to get up here today. It was, it like last night, it said it was supposed to rain today, but then when I woke up this morning, it's not like actively raining right now, but it's definitely really foggy. Like basically it's a, I think like three and a half mile drive, like on this like specific road up to the top of Cadillac Mountain and it was like really foggy the whole time. what the weather is out right now it's reminding me of seattle like it's raining but it's not like pouring it's just like drizzling but luckily it's been super nice the whole time i've been here this is like the only day that it's been raining so today was a little bit of a flop between like all the fog this morning and not being able to see the sunrise and then this but that's okay i just had lunch i got these like crab cakes that were good and then i also got i got like two appetizers i also got this like pork belly appetizer that was really yummy but now i'm going to drive to the airport the restaurant i went to it was called blaze and it was right by this coffee place that i've been going to so i got the same the brown sugar oat milk espresso iced yeah that's it for this vlog thanks so much for watching it was so fun gotta explore a new place a little solo trip but yeah i'm going to the airport now and basically at the airport i'm just gonna read my book it starts with us i will probably finish it today if i had to guess so yeah subscribe if you want to see more videos and i'll talk to you in my next one bye <laughs>